Hello guys, welcome to an Arduino tutorial and today we are going to get a melody to play through a buzzer. This lesson is part of the Ultimate Arduino Beginner's Guide series and this is lesson 12. So today you will only need some very basic things, um, not a lot of equipment, you'll need an Arduino Uno, a breadboard or an alligator clip and a piezoelectric buzzer. Now, uh, I haven't done a wiring diagram for this project because the wiring is so simple it doesn't need it. You need to wire one side of your uh, buzzer to ground and you need to wire the other side of your buzzer to digital pin 8. So get that wiring done. Uh, it would be very easy to use alligator clips in this one but if you haven't got them, a breadboard would be fine. So let's have a look at the code. Uh, this is the first part of code that we're going to be using. And it's not it's not too hard, but it might look hard before we actually look at it and realise what it's all about. So let's have a look at it. The first line of code is int melody. Now int melody, uh, we've just declared an integer variable and we're going to call it melody. And then we are saying that melody is note C4, note G3, note G3, note A3, note G3, naught, note B3, note C4. So by putting all of them notes in a curly bracket, a set of curly brackets after int melody equals, we're saying that, that is what a melody is equal. So that are the notes that we're going to be using today. And then next we are setting the note duration, so we're creating another integer variable, int note durations, and um, we are saying they are 4884444. Now you might be wondering what that means. Well, 4 is a quarter of a note, 8 is an eighth of a note, saying that um, 2 is a half of a note. Now we know that when we're setting up a piezo buzzer, there is two steps. Uh, so the step one is to declare the notes in the melody, and we've done that by creating an integer variable and putting in the notes. And then step two is to set up the note durations, so in note durations 4884444, with a four, four being a quarter of a note and eight, and eight being an eighth of a note. So now let's look at the next part of code. Uh, we have uh, put it in a void setup because there is no need for it to repeat. So if we wanted it to repeat, we put it in a void loop. So in the void setup, first we need to iterate over the notes of the melody. So this line of code 4, int this note equals naught, um, semicolon, this note uh, less than 8, colon this note plus plus now what this does is it just goes over the notes of the melody one two three four five six seven just like that and then to calculate the note duration take one second divided by the note type e.g quarter note equals a thousand divided by four an eighth of a note equals a thousand divided by eight now just now we were looking uh, at the well, in, before the void setup, we were setting note durations like 4, and we said that would be a quarter of a note, 8, we said that would be an eighth of a note. What we need to do now is transfer that into language that the uh, Arduino will understand by dividing it um, by a thousand. So, an int note duration equals a thousand over note durations this note. So, basically, let's have a look at close to that. Um, Let's have a little look at that line closer. By saying int note duration equals a thousand, we've now created an integer variable um, and we've set it as a thousand. And we've said int note duration equals a thousand over note durations this note. Now this note is like one, two, three, four, five, and note durations we set really as like four, four, eight, 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 or something like that. So we're going to do a calculation there for each of the notes one two three four five six seven and then the next part tone tone eight melody this note note durations now what this note what this line of code will do is it will 
It's the actual line of code that actually plays the melody. And what it does is, it says 8 melody this note. So, you've set the uh, notes, and we've set the numbers. So it's going to play each, num each note for the note duration we've set. Okay, to distinguish the notes, set a minimum time between them. The note's duration, plus 30%. Uh, works quite well. So we've said int pause between notes, we've just created a new integer variable equals note duration times by 1.3. Now you might not be very good at maths but to work out a percentage uh, or a percentage increase if we think about um, the pause between notes that's 1. So 1.3 is that plus 30 percent. So we're timesing the note duration by 1.3 to get to the pause between notes. <coughs> and then we're having a delay pause between notes, so it's going to delay the program by, however, by uh, the note duration times 1.3. And then finally, we need to stop the tone playing. No tone, 8. And then to end the code, we just do a void loop because there's no need to repeat the melody. Uh, but we do have a void loop. You might be wondering why we're doing it if there's nothing in it. You always need to have a void setup and a void loop in every single Arduino program. So, challenge yourself. I've set you two challenges. Uh, try and play different notes at different times. That's a typo, it should say times. So, have a look at the notes. Uh, try and play different notes and change what order they're in. And also, try and change the note durations. And when you've done both of these, you'll have a completely different melody. Experiment with this melody until you have a good one that's unique, and obviously that sounds good. So try and write your own piece of music, and edit the Arduino code, so that you've got, you know, your own piece. And that is all for today. Thanks for watching, and be sure to watch my many other Arduino tutorials. I am sorry that the microphone sounds a bit weird on this one, I don't know what's wrong with it, but thanks for watching and be sure to watch my many other Arduino tutorials.